it's Cat and Nessa. Yeah, it's Cat and Nessa. Yeah, it's Cat and Nessa. I don't trust anybody, don't even trust myself I was out here, I would even rub myself If I could, that my son is drunk as hell Try but we still out here in the hood Bounce it down now Back where we never left Um, hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel As you know, I'm Kat I'm Nessa We're finally together after God knows how long We're trying to do a quick story time because we've got things to do Um Menachash Chronicles is what we're going to be talking about today. So Ick. let's get into let's get the right. video. Yeah, so let's okay. get into it. So, um, basically, I think this was my 20th birthday. Mm -hmm. I had like a party and then like after my birthday, we were going to go for a barbecue. So my party was on the Friday mm -hmm. and then we were going to go to the barbecue on the Saturday. So... We go to this barbecue now, and I don't think you were there. No, I wasn't. No. no. Okay. So, star. So, yeah. So, I, it was three of us: me, Belina, and my other friend Grandma. We all decided to go to this barbecue, and I meet this guy. The barbecue like turned out it was for old people, so we were like big hmm. uncles. Yeah. So we were literally the youngest people there, if you know what I mean. So anyway. We go to this barbecue. I meet like we meet two young guys, like youngish, mm. youngish, mm. young. Anyway, at this time I was obviously single. I was twenty. Yeah, I was down um, for a good time. I was willing to date, basically. <laughs> if you haven't subscribed to our video yet, make sure you subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Make sure you like the video if you want to see more of us. Mm. Like, you know, so I meet this guy, you know, he's he's selling me dreams. Hey, cute, he's telling me, hey, know. cutie, mm -hmm. hey, hey, honey, like. And these times when you're 20, like, you get gassed by anything mm -hmm. because it's like, oh my god, like, this guy is chatting to me. What? What? Exactly. This guy was selling me the world, guys. Like, he said to me, he's gonna take me shopping. He's. Like, I never had nobody tell me he's gonna take me shopping. Like, I'm sure. Did he ever take you shopping? No, he never did. These empty promises. He never took me shopping. I still want my shopping speed. If you're watching this video, you know who you are. You know who you are. Mm. <laughs> anyway, he told me he'll take me shopping. He, you know, it was my birthday, so he was like, you know what? Um, The following weekend after we had met up, he said to me, okay. I'm coming to Manchester. He didn't live in Manchester. I'll say he lived in London. So he was like, he's gonna drive down to um, he's gonna drive down to Manchester, Manchester mm -hmm. and we're gonna go, you know, for dinner and one then, two one two in it. Yeah, one two one two. We're gonna go for dinner, and then he's gonna take me shopping. Okay, I told my friends about him, like, guys, you know, I found me a nigga, I found me, I found me I a found, man, I the love me. of my life, babe. I found me a man who loved me, he loved me, he gonna take me shopping, he gonna take me shopping, <laughs> he gonna spend money on me, he gonna spend the cash, like, I was, I was even like to my friend, go, what do you want? <laughs> What Need a holiday? Want? I got it. <laughs> what you want, bitch? Cause my boyfriend, my new man here, he's gonna take me shopping. So whatever you want, you best gonna you, get it, you best gonna friend. Get it because you my man, my my man, <laughs> my man, go oh, get, get it, bro. Go get it. Nothing. Don't worry. So my friend was like, "Yeah, make sure you get me something cute, cute," and I'm like. Go, I got you. I, I got, got you. you. <laughs> Don't worry. You know what? I was a clown. <laughs> anyway, this guy's texting me every day, every second, every minute. He's calling me at night. Like he's doing what like a man should do. Mm. And I'm like, when he's trying to you know pursue a lady. Yeah, I'm like he's mm. giving me the attention. I had no problem. Like, he's giving me all the attention. Mm. Anyway, fast forward to when he's actually supposed to take me on a date. Clown, I know. 
So, and I'm waiting, I'm waiting. It's now 3 p.m. He was supposed to be here at 12. Where is he? Where is he? Not Where a single are text, you? not a single call. And then it's like 5 p.m. I'm like, the shops are finna get closed. <laughs> Can we? Can we? Be like, sir, can you get it? It's now 6 pm. Mm -hmm. I'm like, where's my guy? Where's my. <laughs> Where's my, where's my where's my boyfriend where's my, where's like, my, where's my where's my is he okay i was actually genuinely worried mm. and because i was still 20 i was still very naive like i believed what guys told me if a guy told me like his car broke down i believed that his car broke down so anyway he told me that his car broke down <laughs> He told me his car broke down. How convenient that the How? car breaks down on the same day that you're meant to be taking this girl. And he's like, he's 30 minutes from um, Manchester. And you know, I was like, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I wish I could help. Oh, so sorry, dude. This guy was coming all the way from London. From London. To Manchester. And anyway. for some reason, 30 minutes to Manchester, his car, his car breaks down. Because he had set off at like 11. 10? and it's five guys six hours no anyway, so what what happened was what had happened was <laughs> what had happened was <laughs> so anyway i'm telling my friend oh his car broke down oh, i'm so sad my friend was like boo he ain't coming his car did not break down <laughs> i was like you're hating my my guy is coming he's gonna get a taxi if he has to <laughs> He's gonna get a taxi. He gonna get here. He gonna be here tonight. <laughs> Obviously, he can't take me shopping. Fair enough. I wasn't like, I wasn't so too impressed because I just wanted to spend time with him. Him, mm. you know, if you like someone, it's like, you know, I just want to. Yeah, I just want to spend time with you. He was a nice guy. He was, yeah. I don't want to say too much about him so that he becomes known. But yeah. Anyways, fast forward, he didn't come. I actually went on his Snapchat. I see him at a barbecue somewhere else. Do you know how my heart felt? Like, my <laughs> maybe he's at home. You start thinking maybe he's at no, home. No, no, no. My heart was broken. He told me he's on the motorway, but he's at a barbecue. So I'm like, am I an idiot? Do I have mug written over I'm me? I must have. I must have. So I text him. I'm like, so you think I'm you? think i'm a mug you think you <laughs> really thought you really thought that you could do this to me to me <laughs> things like that don't happen to me <laughs> all the time they do. <laughs> they do all the time i asked him like what's going on like you know what make you make sense i should have just cut him off right then and there but silly me so, no, you know what? It's because he told me that oh, his friend is using his Snapchat. Honey, honey, <laughs> like I know I'm his, naive. His but... friend was not using his snap, but I, I, in the back of my head, I knew that his friend was not using his snap. What did you try but, to make excuses like? But I, I just like the guy. I was like, you know what? I like him. You know. <laughs> you like even saw the guy. <laughs> <laughs> you have to question why. I was why like, you is know it? what? I like him. You know, I just, I just like him. I like the lifestyle he can give me. <laughs> <laughs> Bear in mind, she hadn't even got the lifestyle. She got promises of a lifestyle, but nothing had been done. I'll take you shopping. Has not gone shopping. I'll take it. To, not even some of my daughters. <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't talk to him for a bit because I was hella annoyed. Like I was like, how could you do me like that? Things like that don't happen to me. Mm -hmm. Like, if don't waste my time. Mm -hmm. Anyway, he come back apologizing. I'm so sorry, babe. You know this happened. This happened. This happened. Sweet you know, nothing. you know when you get told all the things that you want to hear. Like, mm -hmm. you know, me and you, we just yeah, whatever. Anyways, fast forward a few days later, I had forgiven him and we were back to talking. He was back to calling me every day. He was back to being my boo. He was back to being my man because he said he was going to come the following weekend and take me out then. I was like, you know what, it's cool, whatever, just make it up to me. He mm. said he was going to make it up to me double this time, you know. So, double of that thing. <laughs> Let's fast forward a couple days of us talking because we didn't talk for long. We talked for like two weeks. 
um i now request him on instagram because i'm like i want to see your instagram i want to see your pictures you know we've only seen each other once so i can't even remember what you look like babe so he tells me oh i don't really use social media what 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 I'm like fair enough fair enough you already know it's a trap so me obviously you know girls you know what we gotta do we gotta be on our fbi shit you know what i mean so i asked my friend girl please go follow Find this him. go follow this guy mm. because there's something he's hiding how can he have like a hundred pictures but but he's not active on social media you know what i mean i don't even have a hundred pictures on my instagram oh so my friend went and followed him and w what do we see and pictures of him and his girlfriend from like years and years and years ago to a recent like like a few days ago he posted his girl like happy 50th anniversary babe i'm like <laughs> it's like what am, am i missing something I like, what am i like <laughs> is that his sister like i was so confused because honestly even though this has happened to me before like guys always try to make me their side chick i don't know why i don't know why like it's like they want you do i give like, like side chick energy or something i don't know <laughs> you I are what you attract <laughs> like i actually don't know like do i give up some negative vibes because at the end of the day like this has happened to me Too far many more times. than you that you think and uh, i've got stories for you for days let's just call this part one because <laughs> I've got too many stories of when guys have tried to make me their side chick. And usually they tell me that their girlfriend, like, you know guys will even post their girlfriends in front of your face. And you ask, who that girl? They'll be like, oh, that's my cousin still. That's my cousin. Who am I to question his cousin? That's his cousin. You know what I mean? If he says that's his cousin, that's his, that's cousin. his cousin. But more time, it's his girlfriend. And I have... I have way too many stories to tell you about that. Anyway, so I confronted him about this and I was like, how dare you? Like, how dare you try and make me your side chick? Like, where do you even have the time? Like, you're talking to me 24-7. You're calling me all the time. Mm. Where do you have the time to talk to your girlfriend? Like, make, it make, make it make sense. So obviously, I now block this guy because it's like, you know what? It's only been two weeks, so cut your loss whilst you know it's not worth it. Like, because guys was still trying like sweet talk you. Like, I don't love her. I love you. She crazy. You the one that I want. Like, then why are you with her? Like, clearly you love her. So let me just cut my loss. The thing is, like with guys, when you don't want to be with someone, mm -hmm. it's so easy for you to just cut them off or just air them or go. Why them cheat on somebody? Like, like just break up with them. It's literally it's so simple. Like you don't need to be in that relationship if you are tempted by somebody else or if you can entertain somebody else's conversation. And you know what? Yeah, the thing what this story also taught me is that guys always want to cheat with like someone who's like the complete opposite of their girlfriend oh, like complete opposite oh, you couldn't even put us in the same <laughs> it's, like, it's like what is the do you know what it's like when um thingy the girl shoot with a skinny 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 girl but i'm like wh why are you at me then like why you are know you what? here if that's your time you know what i mean like obviously your girlfriend is probably skinny like do you want to eat both <laughs> pieces of the cake like what like do you want do you so like do you want to just try things out see mm. like i don't get it like that's your type stick to your type you know what i mean men in their wicked ways oh, you want everything you want to eat ev everything, everything. No. you want to eat every cake everybody cake and stick to that it may not even it may be a pastry you want to just yummy you want to just yum 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 <laughs> I just pick something. Biscuits, what? <laughs> Chocolate, what? <laughs> He, he didn't get what he wanted anyway from so, me. Yeah. You know, all he did was waste his time and my time yeah. because 
But the other day, if he was there for something, because you know sometimes guys come for like, you know, they a just want to sleep wants with wants you. They it. wanna, you know. He didn't yeah. get none of that from me, so it was like cut my losses whilst and stuff. Fast forward a few months later, guess who I bumped into? I see this guy, and who's he with? He's on a date with another girl who's not his girlfriend. And you know what? It's just one of those situations where you just like. <laughs> I was just like, <laughs> sounds like, uh, yeah. So he's on another day, and I'm just like, you know, mm -hmm. whatever. I at least I, you know, because obviously I wasn't the only girl he was talking to. There must have been hundreds and millions and, and thousands, thousands and billions. <laughs> you know what I mean? I was just one of the few. But it's like, okay. where do you find the time? Where do you actually find time to be talking to all these girls? But anyway, it was what it was. I bumped into him a few months later with his girlfriend and he was like, Oh babe, that's my friend, that's my friend. I'm like, should I tell her? Should, should I, I tell her? You know what? The girl was so sweet. The girl was so nice. They're always nice, aren't they? And They're I was just like, so you know what? I, will, nice. I don't want to break her heart because at the end of the day, nothing really happened between her and her, me, you and, him, yeah. me and her man. So... Who am I to now, you know, break up their relationship? Because most times when a guy's cheating on you, you know, like, mm. you probably just... She probably had an inkling that, like... She probably had an inkling that... Cheating. Because I'm not the only one. I'm not the only one. And she knows that. So, obviously, I was just like, she's a sweet Isn't girl. Isn't it funny that he took the other girl on a date, but he still didn't take you on a date? Anything, it's okay because I cut my losses quick. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? She was on the Nando's there anyway. Like <laughs> nothing. Yeah. I mean, excuse me, Nando's is actually quite paying still. I can take myself to Nando's every every day if I wanted to, to without feeling any type of. I can go to, to Nando's honest. for my dinner every day. Every day like, without feeling some type of. That's not even a date. That's just you know. I mean, it, it is a day because I did go on a few Nando's days. I can't lie mm. to you, but. You know, it's not something that I'll cry over. If he was going to take me to a shard, then... Yeah, maybe. Maybe right now I'll be like, you know what? I need to text away. Yeah. <laughs> Where he at? He's out I'm me. in London. <laughs> I come to see you, baby. Anyway, so that was that guy. Uh, if you guys want to know more about my dating experiences, and trust me, I'm not saying I'm a hoe, but there's loads. <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of trash men. That the, I've met doing. a lot of trashy men. That's why, like, I'm so picky and, like, I'm, I've am i been single for a while, so mm. that's why. So, that's me. Yeah. Yeah. Well, thank you guys for watching our video. I don't know when it's going to come out, but whatever you do, don't forget to like and comment. And subscribe. Hold Thank you. Bye. Toodles. Bye. Okay. Yeah.